Hi, welcome back to Geek Out with Tarek. And the idea I want to share with you is this. Climate change is something that's happening within our lifetimes, and the time to act is now. There's an observatory, the Mauna Loa Observatory in Hawaii, which has been monitoring how much carbon there is in the atmosphere since 1958. So when my dad was four years old, the CO2 concentration in the atmosphere was just under 320 parts per million. Um, and today that number has been over 400 parts per million since you know, about, about 2014. So that's a, that's a dramatic increase um, over the lifetime of my, my dad at least. Um, but the interesting thing with this red line is that over the course of a year, it kind of goes up and down. And the reason it goes up and down is because that's literally the Earth breathing. So uh, in, the, in the warmer months, the hotter months, uh, trees, they suck carbon dioxide out of the atmosphere. So all the trees in the world are kind of going, sucking in the CO2. And in the cooler months, they sort of exhale and release that CO2 back. So while there is that seasonal variation, on average, it sort of goes up uh, over time. So why am I talking about this chart with 60 years of data? Well, the World Bank just released a report called Groundswell, which estimates that by 2050, climate change could cause internal migration for something like 140 million people. There's, there's people who are displaced from climate hotspots within their country and have to migrate to other places to maintain their livelihoods. 2050 is not that far away. At the start of the Mauna Loa chart, my father was four years old. In 2050, I'll be the same age as my father is today. The time to act is now.